Aloha, everybody. Welcome back to Vision Quest Astrology. This is Kyle. Thank you very much for joining me in my astrological corner on YouTube. I have become increasingly fascinated with uh, draconic astrology. Draconic astrology, to me, is uh, it's it's not as widely practiced. It's not as widely uh, looked into in the astrological realm, and but it is getting more focused than it used to. You know, if you go to astro.com and you use them to look at your different charts and whatnot, you'll find the draconic chart on the very bottom of the lineup. So I want to just explain um, what draconic astrology is, uh, how it benefits you and um, everyone else, and why it's, I feel like, another important tool to learn and know and be aware of. Basically, what the draconic chart is doing is it's taking uh, the north node. So it takes wherever your chart was at the time you were born, it takes the north node and at that time places it at the zero degree point of Aries, which is the natural um, and home placement for the north node. All your planets stay in the same houses that they're in. And so that doesn't change, but the signs all change and their aspects to each other change based on what the chart would look like if it was placed at that zero degree point of Aries. That zero degree point of Aries is the true soul incarnation. And that is exactly what draconic astrology is about. It's about the soul. It's about the spirit. It's more, I see it as what your soul was and still is, but even more so before it came to this earth. And that's probably why a lot of people don't look into it, because more people are interested, okay, what's my personality like that I'm here on this earth interacting with other people? How's my communication like in my Mercury? What are my emotions like that can be found in my moon? What's my my ascendance and my, my, my life path? What's my ego like found in my sun sign? And the draconic chart goes above personality, whereas the natal chart is so important for that, our personalities and our persona is such a big deal, it, it can also be a bit limiting. And that's why I love looking at the draconic chart, because it shows you really who you are more on a soul level and who you were before your spirit came into this body, if you even believe in that. Me being huge on spirituality and metaphysical stuff, this uh, is like candy to me. I just eat it right up. So I started really studying it a lot a year ago and it just um, pulled me right in. Being such a soul-based journeyer, my draconic chart really gave me something my natal chart wasn't. And it was showing me this deeper part of who I am and was able to answer questions, at least some questions that my natal chart was not able to. So if there are those of you who are, are really walking a very spiritual path, and even if you're not walking a very spiritual path, but especially so in that case, and want to know more about who you are on soul level and you know things like destiny and, and purpose and, and karma and all of that, that can really be found in your draconic chart. You're more than welcome to check out my website at visionquesthealing.com to book a reading with me if you would specifically like a draconic chart reading. I am offering those. And or you can also email me directly at my astrology email at visionquestastro at hotmail.com. And I would love to work with you guys. I've, I've done a few draconic charts so far and I've had so much fun with it. I am continuing to learn more and more about it daily. And it's just, it's absolutely amazing, mind blowing. So I will probably be making some more videos about it. Um, if I see that people are interested in it, you know, I don't want to keep rambling on and uh, post about it. If people are just like, okay, shut up, dude, we don't care about this. So please leave your comments down below. And if y'all would like to see more about Draconic Astrology on my channel, if you have questions, and like I said, uh, let me know if y'all would like a Draconic chart reading. It's so exciting. I get, I get so excited talking about this stuff. Um, so yeah, that is the main gist for now with Draconic Astrology. So Thank you for watching, everybody, and I really hope you will uh, look into it. It's seriously pretty life-changing. So peace out, everybody, and happy transiting.